Businesses are getting on Facebook at a rapid rate as old traffic sources dry up and social networks continue to boom. The fact is, most businesses and online marketers are going to be too slow to catch the social change that's occurring right now. So what makes Facebook so powerful and now valuable? It's a daily routine for many and one they simply can't do without. This becomes even more apparent when you consider that half of all Facebook's 600 million members log into the network on a daily basis, averaging 30 minutes each. I personally have friends who log into Facebook at the same time every single day. Why? Because that's now what they do. It's become more than just a social network. It's part of their life. And it's not just students anymore. In fact, the fastest growing age group on Facebook right now is between the ages of 35 and 40. Here's why Facebook is so addictive for some and powerful for others. Everyone on Facebook has a profile page others can view as well as Facebook's news feed. The news feed features all the actions of a friend in your network. What this means is that any action your friend takes, you will see. If you have an interest in the action they took, then you too can take an action which will appear in all of your friends' news feeds. This feature makes Facebook the most viral tool in existence. Right now, there are literally thousands of businesses looking for ways to attract customers through social networking. They fear that their competitors are getting online first and snatching their customers right from under their noses. This is because they understand this is the way marketing is going. And Facebook right now is much like Google in its early days, but more powerful. Two years ago, I was sitting in a boardroom, nine directors around me being taunted and told Facebook would never take out. It was just a fad, unprofessional. Today, I'm practically booked out by businesses in desperate need of this information. What's funnier is that one year after being told by this company that Facebook would never take off, I saw a fan page enter my news feed. This fan page was theirs, and that was when I knew I was onto something, something that would one day dictate significant power online. In 2011, I have no doubt that this reality is now upon us as marketers and business owners. And if we don't take action now and learn how to establish your business and ourselves as experts, we will fall behind.